guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I have my little kiddos here, Opal and Luna. Opal, Luna, I don't know if you can really see Luna. Um, so, it's been a minute since I've been on YouTube. It's been since uh, right before I went back to work. I think it was like April or May that I had filmed a hair tutorial. Um, but a lot has changed since then. So I wanted to get back on here. I wanted to give you guys a little video of me introducing myself. Um, I'm planning on starting over and I want to start documenting it. A lot has changed, like I said, since the last time I've seen you. And I just want to kind of give you guys a little bit of a background of who I am and how I got here. So I have a little um, thing that I wrote out just to kind of keep me on track because I tend to think way quicker than I speak and I can kind of get tongue-tied and talk over myself or talk in circles. So I just have this here to keep myself on track and make sure that I'm giving you guys the basics of what I want to give you so that way you feel like you get to know me a little bit and know my story, why I'm here, and what this video kind of entails for the future. I have a glass of wine, as you guys can see, my little vino bottle over there, my little baby. And uh, if you guys want, pause the video, go get yourself a glass of wine. I don't know how long this can go for. I'm gonna try to keep it short and sweet, but having a little chit chat video, you never know where things can go, so. Okay, so I am 26 years old. I know that is still pretty young, and there's days I feel young, there's days I feel old, um, but I am starting over. What that means is I'm doing this all on my own from here on out. Money, business, success, lifestyle, health, fitness, everything I am doing for me and solely me. Um, I think I got bogged down a lot by certain people that were around me and toxic energies and words that I've seen on social media and stuff like that, which a lot of people I think nowadays struggle with having to be so on, um, especially with social media. So this is going to be me being completely me, authentic and raw, um, and just living for me. So I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a background story as to what I've experienced and why I've gotten here and I'm now making a video about about starting over and stuff like that. But seven years ago when I graduated from high school, actually it's been almost 10. It'll be 10 and 20, 22. <laughs> I graduated high school and my number one thing was to go get my doctorate's degree in child psychology. Originally I wanted to be a doctor, then I wanted to be a child doctor, and then I knew I didn't really want to get into the, all the like blood and guts and stuff like that, and I wanted to more so be able to help kids out and talk to them, which is kind of what I'm doing here, just making a little vlog and almost having like a little diary entry, if you will. I was going to school and kind of doing the, the motions, but I wasn't really enjoying it. And I had started receptioning in a salon. And that summer I decided that I wanted to quit going to college and go and get my cosmetology license, which I was super excited about. Um, and the person I was with in that moment, I had told, you know, I am going to be doing this. It's more of a passion thing. It's not going to be about money for me. I've always been that way, um, which I know is funny from the child psychologist to this. It's a very big leap, but that's what I was going to do. I went home and told my mom, who was very supportive and super excited. And then, you know, I've told other people and stuff, and I got very mixed emotions as I think many people do. You get a lot of support and you get people who think this isn't a career, this is something that you do for a hobby, you know, why are you doing this kind of situation? I definitely had that and I 
struggle when I don't please people. I'm very into astrology and I'm a Virgo. I'm a I'm straight up Virgo and people pleaser. And so I think that I let some of that get to me. But going into cosmetology school, I was very gung-ho and ready for it. And I just couldn't wait. I loved going to school. I loved doing what I was doing, making people feel beautiful, learning different things that I was passionate about. And so I started watching YouTube and learning on there and then getting into makeup videos, which I started my own YouTube channel in, in 2014, I believe, and made it a lot about makeup. Um, but then the beauty community just got so bogged down, I feel like, from drama, and it wasn't that. And then I started listening to people's words about me just being a dreamer, and I'll never be the success that I want to be, and everything that I say sounds perfect, but in reality, that's not the life that I'll be able to live, and I'll have to go and work 9 to 5 and be miserable, and blah, blah, blah. And I, I literally started listening to this over time. Um... Everything that anyone would say, if it was positive, it just kind of like went over my head. If it was negative, it like sunk into my soul. And I listened to that. And I started giving up the control that I had over myself to all these other people that I felt I needed to please and, and love and do all this stuff that I stopped loving myself. I stopped doing all the things that I really enjoyed doing. I lost the passion for it and I turned to alcohol and drugs and all this other stuff that is so unhealthy and I think I just, I've started realizing it more and more in this phase in my life that, you know, it's okay if you go through things but you don't have to give up yourself for certain people or a lifestyle or whatever it is. You can grow, but I was staying stagnant. I wasn't growing, I wasn't happy, I wasn't living, I wasn't doing anything. And um, in the area, in the place that I was in in my life, I think that I had a lot of toxic things around me, people, things, whatever it was, that I just, I wasn't getting anywhere. And that's okay, um, but I didn't quite understand that, and I think I'm starting to learn a little bit more now. Um, but then I went on a trip last summer and I think a lot of things came to my, my head that, you know, this isn't the way I want to live. This is not where I want to be. These are the people that I don't want around me or these are the situations I don't want around me. I need to start taking little by little steps to creating that life that I want. And so I did. And when I got back, I um, decided to let the place of business that I was working know that I was actually going to be going out on my own and experiencing the life of having my own salon by myself. And so I opened my own salon suite back in October last year, which I was so pumped about because it was like, finally, the dreamer that I was was coming through and I was going to be living the life that I wanted and um, it was going to be great. And then I think the negativity started coming back in and I started living the same lifestyle that I had been living now for like the last three years and it just, it wasn't working for me. And I was very unmotivated and I was very just, I wasn't there, I wasn't me. I mean, even today, like looking at this, like I'm not me, but I'm working on it. I just started working out two weeks ago and I'm working on it. Um. So recently, I actually just decided that I'm going to start doing this everything on my own. I need to get out. I need to be by myself. I need to start doing things for me and giving myself the life that I want because I have, I think, just sunken into this person that I didn't know who I was and relied on so many other people and things that I just, I let myself go completely. I wasn't there. I had no love for myself. I had no nothing. Um, and I listened to all of those people saying, you're not going to be the person you want. You're not going to be this, this inspiration and success on YouTube, or you're not going to be able to rack in all this money that all these other hairdressers do because this and this and this. And I listened and it's just like, no, stop. So here I am. I'm making this video because I'm starting over. I'm taking today as like the number one day of starting over. I want to start giving you guys 
my health and fitness journey. I plan on losing anywhere between 40 to 30 pounds. Like I said, I've been working out for the last two weeks. So I want to bring you guys along with me on that journey. I want to start loving who I see in the mirror. I want to start getting my clientele and future clientele to see what I do on a day to day. I want to inspire other hairdressers who are thinking about starting their own little business in salon suite. I want to just do all these things that I've dreamed of. I want to make them reality. And one of them is being on YouTube and sharing my life. So this space from here on out is going to be to grow and to learn and to be a dreamer and dream and make your dreams a reality um, and just to heal. I want to be able to heal through this. I want others to see this and feel like they can heal along with my journey or start their journey of healing wherever they see it from. And I, um, I'm going to share it all. I'm going to be completely authentic and raw with you guys because I know that it's easy to film something and just give people what you want them to see. But I want you guys to see all of it. There's obviously days that I'm going to struggle more than others, but I really want to be on here and be creative and share my life with you guys because my thing has been that I've always felt like I am going to connect with people and inspire people and I love being on YouTube. I loved creating makeup looks and all that stuff and I do want to give you guys a little bit more of my life so I want to vlog a little bit more um, and just do that. So here we are. It is November 30th. The new month of December is starting. We're getting ready to trans transform, transfer into 2021. And I don't want to wait until 2021 to start living out the goals and dreams that I have. I want to start living a 2021 lifestyle in 2020. I plan on posting once a week to give you guys whatever kind of video I'm planning on putting out there. It's going to be health, fitness, Salon, beauty, makeup, lifestyle, whatever. I want to start with one and then hopefully move up from there. So there might be some weeks where you get more than one video. But my goal for right now is to just do one. I tend to overwhelm myself a lot and put too much on my plate. So this is going to be a learning experience for me. Um, we obviously live in 2020 and I know that Social media and YouTube is so big now and there's so many people doing it and the content is so much better and blah, blah, blah. But I really am just starting out again. I don't have the same equipment and all of that stuff. There are areas in my life that I have more, but I'm filming this right now on my iPhone because the camera I had broke. So I know that like this might not be the top notch videos that you see everywhere, but Stay with me. We're going to grow together. Like I said, I'm going to be authentic and real with you guys. And uh, I just, I want you guys to come along on this ride with me. I want you to do this if this is something that you've been wanting to do. And I just want to live this new life. I want to start over. So this is my first video of starting over. And it's going to be a great time. We're going to start being the successes that we know we can be. We're going to continue to be the dreamers that we want to be. We're going to be these healthy, amazing spirits. And I can't wait. And I hope that you guys want to come along with me. Um, if there's anything specific that you guys want to see on this channel, please leave me comments down below. If you guys want to follow along with me or know anything about me, you can also go to my Instagram and follow me on there or message me or whatever. I'd love to chit chat with you guys. Um, if you want, like this video, subscribe to my channel. Like I said, I'm going to start posting more and I just can't wait. That, again, is my background. That is why I'm doing this. That's why I'm here. We're getting ready to get back on YouTube and make this freaking bomb. So let's do it, okay? I hope that you guys all stay loving yourself, stay beautiful, and yeah, that's all. I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.